in its endeavor to make rockets used for launching satellites reusable, the Indian Space Research Organization ISRO, will explore for the first time the possibility of runway landing of rockets just as airplanes do at airports. After releasing the satellite, the launch vehicle, which has no pilot, will fall very steeply through the sky. It will come like a falling football. We need to change its angle in such a manner that it comes and lands automatically with the help of wings," said ISRO Chairman Case of here on Friday. For the technology demonstration, scheduled to be carried out in the middle of this year, ISRO will take the shuttle to an altitude of 3 km using a helicopter and drop it. The shuttle is designed in such a manner that it would land automatically on a runway. According to a senior ISRO official, an airport at Chalake here, near Bengaluru, will be used for the experiment. This is the second such experiment in reusable launch vehicle technology being carried out by the space agency. In 2016, ISRO successfully test flew a winged experimental reusable launch vehicle RLV, that splashed down in the sea after reaching an altitude of 65 km. Reusable launch vehicles are expected to slash the cost of space launches to almost one-tenth. Apart from the RLV technology demonstration, ISRO also plans to carry out the maiden flight of its small satellite launch vehicle, SSLV, a rocket capable of carrying a payload weighing between 300 and 500 kilograms, in July. An SSLV can be integrated in 72 hours, making launches on demand a reality. If anybody approaches ISRO to launch a small satellite, we would be able to launch it in three days flat, said the ISRO chairman.